Hello guys, happy Thursday, uh, Cerebral Palsy Awareness Month daily video, um, 10, I cannot believe it's almost 10 days since I've been filming, I've been pre-filming and also filming actual videos, um, but today's video is gonna be a catch up. It's going to be a life update. It's going to be a lot of things. A lot of transitional. A lot of changes in the next couple of weeks. Which I am looking forward to. And some I'm not looking forward to, to them. Um, but that's how you grow. That's how life changes. And that's how we grow. Um, the first... Life changes, I am going to be going more more on a daily outing kind of things and getting back to my work um, schedule. Um, and then the next one is potentially going back to school. I have a meeting on Friday. Um... To talk about going back to school, I'm thinking in August 2022, I'll do that as going back to school online. Um, and also in April, first week of April, I am going back to work or I'm set to go back to work. Um, first week of April, I can't tell you where I was working because of companies uh regulations or um but yeah i am getting back to my new normal i don't like this change but uh it's scary it's nervous because um i've been at home for three years i've been at home for longer than that even because i started online school about since 2017, 16, I started an online school about 2017 to 2021. 20, so I've been online and doing online things, but I was active going to the grocery store, going to dance, going to work in the last year or so. Um, but I... Um, I stopped all of that for like two years, but now I'm coming back to all of that. Um, so technically I haven't left the house for, um, five years, but also for three years because I was, I was still doing my daily tasks. I was still going to dance class. Um, I was still... By, uh, like, the beginning of 2019, I stopped going to dance class. Um, because we started f finding out that the world is um, changing to hybrid, to virtual. So, we decided to keep me virtual, but we didn't know how long. But this this transition now, um, pray for me. I really need well wishes. Um, I'm kind of nervous, kind of excited. All different emotions. Kind of nervous to get back into the swing of things because I don't want to get sick or end up in the hospital um but you guys know that um I had a lot of problems with my teeth and a lot of problems with my mouth and I think we had the virus um, back then in 2020 um but um yeah I'm Finally, where I can say it firmly, 
to finding my new normal. This is like a new chapter. I kept saying in some videos I want to find my new normal. But this is all set in stone. I will be doing this by the end of Cerebral Palsy Awareness Month actually. So yeah, I'm just getting ready to transition. Um, and I am... I don't know how I feel about it. Um, there's a lot of anxiety, a lot of stress, a lot of depression because I'm kind of restarting my life. Um, because I had not a caregiver. Um, my mom was just my caregiver. Also my mom. So, she... So now we have to try to get a caregiver and start that again. But I don't know how I feel about this. And hopefully in the midst of things I don't get over too overwhelmed where I get sick or feel sick. So um, just, you know, give me well wishes. Get me encouragement because we all need encouragement on this transitional thing after you've been home for three years um but yeah i am really excited really nervous though um this is uh this is a big step for me to reintegrate myself in the community and re-include myself Inclusion is a big key to my well-being and um, to see who's CP smart as for Niha is or um, there's no limits to having CP with Niha. That's my YouTube channel name. That's my YouTube channel name. Sorry, my voice got out there because it's late at night and I'm tired because I had dental... Dance class tonight, a uh, Zoom dance class, which, um, yeah, this is Wednesday when I'm filming this. Uh, so week nine already went up for Cerebral Palsy Awareness Month. That, that video already went up, but week 10 didn't go up, and it's really late here, and I'm getting tired. Um, even more now, but we will, we still have to grind and get YouTube videos out for you guys. So, yeah, I'm really nervous, really excited. Um, what is really going on? I just wanted to be honest and open with you guys. Um, if somebody's going through this transition or transition similar to mine, you got this. Um, your life or your things will come back together. Um, like I say, in all of my videos, life is a puzzle piece. So what I'm, what I'm saying about that life is a puzzle piece and you have the main base, you just have to fit fit in those pieces, and sometimes they break, and then sometimes they fit in well, and then sometimes you open up new pieces and make, um, make a ladder or make more puzzles to your jumbled life. Um... And or kind of make it your own. So I'm kind of restarting my life. Um, and reintegrating myself into this community. Um, so I thank you guys for all your support. All your encouragement. Thank you guys for all the new comments on Facebook for these videos. Um, if you're not following me on Facebook, you can follow me at CP Smiles for Niha. If you're not following me on YouTube, uh, you can follow me on There Is No Limits to Having 
CP with Niha. Um, or just search my name. Um, and it should come up. Um, but yeah. It has been a long time coming to where I can say I'm finally, finally, finally changing things. And I know for some people change might be the hardest thing ever. But honestly, change is worth it. Change is magical. Um, Change is the light at the end of the tunnel for some of us. I know it might be hard. I am nervous. I'm anxious. I'm emotional. Um, because I'm going back to the things I love to do. Um, but honestly, I am happy and excited at the same time. And that's all you can be when you're, um, transitioning into your new normal and you're having your life back together. Uh, The puzzle pieces come back together. So, I just wanted to say um, that for you today and talk. I feel like the last few videos weren't t- me talking. They were just me kind of doing short, short little segments. Of my day or of my saying or some motivational quotes. Um, But this video I wanted to really kind of talk to you guys. And really open up about how I'm feeling. And also how I'm feeling in Cerebral Palsy Awareness Month. And doing content for you guys like this. And having more upbeat, more blogging every day. I'm feeling great about it. I hope you guys are feeling great and I hope you guys have your notifications on with the bell ring to all videos. Um, But yeah, I really appreciate the love and support. Go green. Um, Let's paint the world green. And we will see you, I will see you tomorrow for day 11 of Cerebral Palsy Awareness Month. Bye guys, happy Thursday and I will see you tomorrow. Bye guys. Happy day 10. Bye, guys.